The Teddy Roosevelt mint julep. Speak softly and carry a big drink. Cheers. This is all the president's drinks. Teddy Roosevelt described himself as an exceedingly temperate man, but he did enjoy a julep with mint grown on the White House grounds. Mint juleps are made with whiskey as the main ingredient. Teddy Roosevelt's was a little different from the modern recipe, which always uses bourbon. Teddy Roosevelt liked rye in his mint julep, plus a little brandy. Start with a handful of fresh mint leaves. By a handful, I mean maybe a dozen mint leaves. Depends on how big they are. To the mint leaves, add a teaspoon of sugar and a teaspoon of water. And then you're going to muddle them. Now, muddling is just a way to get the flavors to come out and combine with each other. Sometimes people muddle in a circular motion. With this, I like to do sort of like an up and down pounding motion just to get the mint to release its flavors. And this is a traditional mint julep cup, which I love because then you can muddle and make the drink all in one cup. Then you're going to add some crushed ice. Then we're going to add a tablespoon of brandy, which is about a third of a shot. And now we'll add two shots of rye whiskey. And now look, I know the bourbon people are freaking out right now. It's going to be fine. We're just making it the way that Teddy Roosevelt liked it. Okay, now you stir it just a little bit, not a lot. You wanna keep the mint on the bottom as much as possible, so just give it a light stir. Now we're putting in more crushed ice because this is the kind of drink you wanna like sip on a hot summer day. And a little sprig of mint on the top. Teddy Roosevelt loved a mint julep. <laughs> Teddy Roosevelt <laughs> He had a couple of secret ingredients that made it a Roosevelt. <laughs> oh, I just gotta get it out.